Hi there, I'm Rhonda and I help makers turn their digital designs into income. On my channel, you'll get quick tutorials, cool tools, and simple strategies to grow your digital product business. If you want daily AI prompts, trend tips, and a fun community that gets it, join us in our AI Profit Society. I left a link in the description. Don't forget to like and subscribe so you don't miss a thing. And now without any further delay, let's get into today's video. Hey everybody, it's Rhonda. Um, I did a video yesterday showing you how to uh, create a talking avatar using uh, Hedra. And I had somebody ask in the comments uh, if I could do a video showing how to uh, take these short video clips and put them together to make one longer video in Canva. So that's what I'm going to do. Here is one, you know, here's a few video clips I did in Hedra and I saved each one of these as its own short video clip. And what I did when I downloaded them as I named them video one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. So I know which order I want to use them in. All right, so once I had all my clips downloaded and I know what order I wanna put them into when I go to Canva, we're just gonna come over here to Canva and on the home page, you see all these different options across the top here, right? And the one we wanna to use today is video. Now, depending on what aspect ratio you made your video clips in, will determine which video you want to choose here. I did all mine in 16.9 landscape, so that's what I'm going to use. If you did yours in 9.16 for like mobile video, you could do this one. So I'm just going to start a new video and you're going to be shocked at how simple this is to put these together to make one long video versus seven or eight short ones. So here is our blank video project in Canva and here are my video clips that I did in Hedra. And I'm just trying to, I just wanna make this a little smaller, okay? And I'm just gonna sit this here and I'm gonna drag video one right here into my timeline, all right? Then I'm going to grab video two and I'm gonna drag it right next to it. And I'm just gonna repeat the process for all the videos that I want to put into this single longer video. I'm just gonna drag each clip down in the order I want it, drop it in. Okay, there's four in, let's drag five in, six, seven, three, yep, seven, and now the eighth one. And we're just gonna drop those all in. In. Okay, so now we have basically one video that's 48 seconds long, but let's go back here and let's just play this quick. One smooth video in Canva. New design. Pick your video size, usually 16 by 9 for YouTube or widescreen. Start a new Okay, and you see how the jumps between clips is not very smooth, okay? We don't want that. We want to do something that will uh, smooth it out, make it seem like it's supposed to at least uh, smoothly transition into your next clip. So if you hover, let me zoom in on this a little bit. Nope, I don't want to zoom in on that. I want to, if you hover down over where your video clip are next to each other, you will see a little button that says add transition. So we're going to click on that. And there's a bunch of different transitions you can use here. Okay. I am going to just use flow. I'm going to pop that in there. And I don't want my duration that long because I don't want it to cut off much of my other uh, clips. I want to keep it pretty clean. And I am going to have it go directionally to the right because that is, oh, that's just the direction I want it to go. So I'm going to hover over the connection here between each clip and I'm going to set it where I want it and the direction I want it and move on to the next one. And again, this is personal. You can do this however you want. You can choose whatever transition you want and you can, you know, play with the directions, the duration of the transition. It's completely up to you. Uh, for me, I don't want it super long. So I'm just going to come in here and add. Okay. So now we have our transitions added between each clip. Now look at the difference. See the difference when I play the beginning of this again. Let's turn them into one smooth video in Canva. Start a new design. Pick your video size. Usually 16 by 9 for YouTube or widescreen. 
Now, upload your short clips and drag them onto the timeline in the order you want them to play. Now, you can trim, split, or rearrange them right on the timeline. Super easy. You can between clips to make it flow. Now, this one here seems to be a little long. I'm not sure why that is. See, let's uh, try and make that a little shorter. Let's try and... Okay. We seem to have a lot of dead space at that end of one, uh, one of those clips, so I just made it a little shorter. You can trim, split, or rearrange them right on the time. Super easy. Add quick transitions between clips to make it flow. Simple fades or slides work great. Then drop in some text. So you see it's a lot smoother. It's not quite as um, seamless as I might like it to be. So I would probably play with these a little bit more, maybe change to a different transition. Let's try this match and move on these last couple and see if that is any better. Okay, go back here. Your logo or even background music to pull it all together. Serious Canva makes video editing feel like drag and drop mad. Try it and thank me that click download, choose MP4, and you've got yourself a clean. And it's a little better. Um, some clips will work better than others. You know, it's really, you just have to play with things to get it the way you want. But that is how you would put them together to make one long video and have these transitions make the jump from one clip to another a little more seamless. Now that's not all you can do here though with Canva. You could now, let's say I wanted oh let's say fireworks okay we could come in here to elements and i could add this one this fireworks gif right we could actually add that to our video let's move it where we want it we could make it a little smaller and you could have that going for however long you wanted and you could have uh, you could edit that a little bit if you wanted it to fade in and out and things like that but you can put all kinds of extra elements into your video clip now so got let's a bunch of little here. video clips sitting around let's turn them into one smooth video in canva start a new design pick your videos so we had the fireworks there you could add some text you could add uh, some music to the background it's completely up to you there's a lot of different stuff you could do in here um, look at this we have this one where it's like just shooting some fireworks. if you had a video that was you know saying something exciting and you're revealing you could have this pop out at any certain time you wanted so let's Size. play. Usually 16 by 9 for YouTube or widescreen. Now, now I don't need any of that in this video clip. I just wanted to show you that you can add extra elements like that. You can add audio if you wanted to have some background uh, music, um, really anything you want. Anything you find here in Canva, you can add to this video to make it even more fun or, you know, more unique or to get uh, the attention, you know, of your viewers. You could put your logo. Let's go in here to my upload images you know if I wanted to uh, put like I said any logo or anything like that I could pop that in to the into the video as well um, let's grab that let's make them smaller you know you could just put whatever you want in pop it in wherever you want it reference um, if I wanted you know like I said my logo or my avatar see here's my avatar let's move that up that's where we want that and don't know why it's make it bigger and then I could just put that down in the corner of the video and I could have it stretch it out if I wanted to and make it sit there for the duration of the entire video if I wanted to so let's go back here to the beginning and we could hit Sitting play around, and let's turn them into one smooth video there it is Canva. got a bunch of little video clips start a new design pick your and that's where that would sit just the entire video so that's how you do it you just drag them and start a new video project drag them in add your transitions to make it a smooth uh, jump from one video clip to the next and once you're done and it's the way you like it just come up here to share download and it would save as the full length video okay one smooth so video that's how, that's how a new it design. is Pick your videos. Just that quickly, you could do it like that. Now, something as short as this, this 47, 48 seconds for all of them, I would actually make this as one single video. Um, I showed you yesterday how to do it using Hedra. Um, I 
will I have some other videos coming out I have one using Galaxy AI to do it and I have a, another video using a couple other tools as well showing you how you can make your uh, talking avatars so you know depending on the program you use you might want to just uh, make something of this length one single video instead of a bunch of little clips but if you do have clips you want to piece together that's how you do it just drag them in add your transitions and then save it as one big video alrighty so I hope you guys found this helpful and I will see you next time